Hi ladies and gentlemen, non road user again. Now just as I predicted in uh, one of my earlier videos, don't ask me which one because I can't recall it, well the title of it, I, I can recall the video but I can't recall what I call it, but in the aforementioned video I did actually predict the chaos that this uh, BBC iPlayer registration clatter would uh, throw up and indeed it seems I've been proved correct because I have just registered with the BBC to access iPlayer now obviously because I am not the slightest bit interested in watching anything on BBC iPlayer I, sorry, I'm just having a quick slurp there. Um, I have entered some uh, spurious details, such as um, where the, the field of uh, date of birth was. I've put uh, the BBC Director General's date of birth in. Um, the email address I've entered the BBC sucks at jimmysavile.com and the postcode I've entered is W1A1AA which for those who don't know is the postcode for uh, BBC Broadcasting House in London and without any verification of those details the message or response back from the BBC server tells me that with those details I have in fact registered for an account to access BBC iPlayer. Absolutely no verification process whatsoever. You can just type in any old bollocks on this site and uh, it will allow you through. I mean, normally you would expect an email back to confirm at least that the email address is actually valid and then you would click a link from the email that they sent, you know, and it would say, please verify this this um, process or whatever, you know, click this link to do it or whatever, right? Just nothing. This just has not been thought through in any way shape or form but as i said i did predict that quite a while ago and that is the bbc for you ladies and gentlemen absolutely useless anyway there you go thanks for watching take care i'll catch you later bye <laughs> Ha 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 ha!